What's going on there, fellow YouTubers? This is Chris from the Mars Anomaly channel. Guys, I got about three short videos I'm going to do for you. Um, you know, I want to, uh, because there's some of them I want to get to, plus I've got others coming up. So I've got some ones I need to show you. It's not like um, there's some good, I mean, you can just tell these things are definitely intelligently made. There's not a whole abundance of them in these particular ones, although there is one that's kind of got a bunch of things all over, strewn all over this hillside. So uh, I'm going to get to that too. So I'm going to try to knock one out or two of them out today. And, uh, and if not, then it'll be done tomorrow. But anyway, uh, I notice a lot of guys have been jumping on board here, and I do appreciate that, all you newcomers. I want to show you one thing. Um, this is, uh, you know, my home channel there, and I've got six people here I want you to check out. If you, if you like my work, you'll probably like theirs too. You've got Christian from the Olympus Sky. He does his own techniques. He's really good at Photoshop. Uh, he's an IT guy. He knows what he's talking about, so he knows how to drag a lot of this stuff out, so... Pretty good channel. Um, Will from What's Up in the, in the Sky. He's got a great channel. You can see right here, What's Up in the Sky.com. He's also got a website. Does a lot of good work here. Um, Santo, he does a lot. Of, I mean, these guys are just like uh, unbelievable. I mean, these guys are great. We got two ladies here. We got Nikki from the, well, she calls her, her channel The Wraith Woman. She's got some good ones too. She's kind of uh, slowed down in some videos right now at the time because she just done a big move and everything else. Um, I'm hoping she'll get back in there because you know I really love the idea of these uh, women doing this. Because here's the thing: they say that women use a, the other side of their brain uh, more than the guys do. Well, that's awesome because you get a different perspective and different views. So, um, and you've got uh, Amazon KC. She does a lot of great work too. She does a lot of commentary as far as like, uh, well, she's into a lot of stuff like I am, like uh, uh, ancient civilizations here on Earth. And if you if you're familiar with like uh, the the Sumerians, the Egyptians, um, you know the Mayans, uh, just about all of these guys talk about their gods, how they came down from the heavens and gave them like uh, agriculture, um, you know, uh, you know, mathematics, you know, uh, language, this, that, and the other. Um, and so, you know, she believes in there's a link between Mars and you know, these ancient civilizations as well. So, and she brings a lot of stuff uh, to, uh, does a lot of good commentary and does like other video bites from other different things to give you guys ideas. So it's, it's pretty good. Now, Space Cadet, I don't know his first personal, but um, <laughs> I just literally uh, just subbed to his channel because he does a great job. Um, he's, uh, he's a video expert uh, of sorts and, um, you know, because he's worked for a big company and so on and so forth. But he does, a, he does a great job. He just did one on my video, but he brought up some wild stuff. And unfortunately, he said it might be his last video. Um, he's only had, like, I think, uh, was it 55 videos or something like that? Uh, maybe less. I'm not sure. I got so many numbers in my head. It's not even funny. But anyway, guys, check any six of these uh, ladies and gentlemen out. Just, I mean, if you like what you see on this channel, check these guys out and, these guys out, and ladies out. And uh, just show them some love. Jump on there and check their channel out. But anyway, guys, let me jump into this. Um... This is the picture you'll be getting, and it is the Opportunity Pan Cam, and it's from 5-19-2014. So, uh, again, this is those kind of low-res garbage pictures, I like to call them. Now, they're not garbage per se, because if you look at this picture right now, you go, wow, that's pretty cool. It looks like a giant crater. And if I'm not mistaken, they are in a crater, or it is in a crater. And if you can see right here, it looks like there's a ledge here at the bottom, uh, bottom left. Like, this may be high up, pretty high up. Um, so, now, if you zoom in, let's just take a look. Okay, you can just take a look around, you know, and just see the mountainous areas and so on and so forth and uh, the basin and stuff like that. But um, when I see things like anything that's white or anything that looks like this, I, I just got to take a peek. I just got to take a look. Um, and there is some things in there, but there's also some other stuff that are just it just stands out. So um, I'm going to show you like one particular thing really jumps out at me. And I want to show you that because uh, even if you don't, you know, really can't see the rest of this stuff that's in here, you will see this other stuff because... Uh, if you just jumped on board, then I don't know if you're familiar with all the videos or everybody's been doing here, but um, uh, like I said, I'd call the other people the Moz team because they do the ones I feel, you know, uh, worthy of doing such things because they're trying to be honestly trying to bring the stuff out. But um, Moz had a great catastrophic event where you can just, I mean, it's just everywhere. You just see stuff strewn and broken to pieces and whatnot. So, so anyway, like I said, now this one here's uh, the opportunity, which is definitely prior to curiosity and this was in 2004 both the opportunity and spirit were put up uh, sent to mars in different times in 2014 they did started doing their thing but anyway so let me jump into the picture now i don't know if you guys can see that but you see how like you just jump in just a hair but i'm only at 300 percent, and this picture is totally getting like totally degraded see it just degrading like mad here i mean it's just insane 
These are low-res garbage pitches, like I like to call them, um, because there's just really nothing to them. So I enhanced them. People have asked me, why do you enhance NASA pitches? What the hell would you need to do that for? Well, because of, for this reason. I'm going to show you why, because this, this anomaly jumps right out. Um, and this is what I'm talking about right here. And it's funny how they'll make areas black, you know, dark areas, so on and so forth, and then real, real light areas. Just concentrate on that, and you, you'll see what I'm talking about. But this is what I'm concerned about right here. And this thing is probably the most in-your-face, it's definitely, you know, intelligently made, and I'm going to show you that right now. Come on, man. Uh, now I'm going to sharpen up just a hair bit, and I'm going to back out because we are at 300%. Um, check this thing out. Are you kidding me? And there's no way of knowing exactly how big this thing is because, like I said, I can back out. Now look at the difference between the base picture, which is really nothing to see, and it's grainy and everything else. And we're just going to smooth it out and pop this stuff to show you guys. Now, like I said, this is, this is kind of funny because it reminds me of a giant Q-tip. And it's stuck in this thing. You can see there's like a top of an opening to this. And this thing actually goes all the way to the back here. See it? It goes all the way to the back. And then it has one, two legs coming out of it. I don't know if you can see that, but it's there. See it right there now? One, two, and the thing actually goes a little further. But whatever that is, it actually goes through. Looks like it goes right through this. So I don't know how big this thing is. I don't know if this is part of it as well. But you can see this thing. It's shiny right there like it's metallic of some sort. Now, I don't know what that stuff is. I couldn't tell you. Now, check this out. It actually has this piece here. There's actually a wire, a hose, a line, piping, call it what you will. It's going from the very bottom here all the way to the top of this. And you can see there's something round right here. Goes across. There's something right here. You can see that they actually are trying to bury and manipulate these stuff, this stuff here. Just trying to, just, yeah, just try to cover it up. I mean, that's basically in a nutshell. And now you can see that right there. So we can bring this out right here a bit more. See it right there? You can just see right there coming through and then going down to here. Now, this to me is just, it's actually eerie to, to just see that stuff. I mean, you can just see stuff laying around, um, just stuff just there. I mean, you know, whether this is um, still in use, so to speak, or if it's not, well, there you go. Regardless, it's there. Um, okay, now I'm going to jump down to this bottom piece here. Check this out. Look at this right here. You can see where this is really not, nothing there. Now, when you do this... Check out this, just the, the shapes of this stuff. Now, I don't know what this stuff is. I couldn't tell you to save my life, but check this out. This right here looks like some kind of weird piece of steel girdering or some kind of flat piece of steel with these darker rectangular areas in it. Now, I'm going to see if I can't move in just a hair bit. So I can show you this a little bit better. See that right there? Rectangular areas. Okay. Check this thing out, too. I don't know if I can sharpen this up a bit. But right, right here, this... Okay, and it has this weird piece coming down from it. But there's a bunch of what looks like, you know, just pieces or tooling or just machine parts. I don't even know. But look at this. comes over, up, the shape of this, and it comes in, down, one, two, and then something right there. I don't know what that is. But look at the squares here, all these weird shapes. And then it has these one, two, and it looks like there's something underneath it. So I don't know if this is like some kind of weird roofing. And then it has this right here, and there's something underneath it. But look at these cool shapes. Look at this. Come, it comes straight down over a little bit. It has a little arch type thing. Actually, it comes down to this way and up and around. These don't look like just regular normal rocks here, guys. I mean, and then there's a bunch of crap all over this. I don't know what that is. I mean, that could be anything from growth from plant uh, growth or just a manipulation, which I'd be more apt to say it's a manipulation. But you've got these, these weird things right here. And I don't know what this is here. I, so I can't really say too much about that. But this right here, you can just see like this... You see, it starts off white, and then all of a sudden turns gray. Like, they just try to blotch it right out, you know. But, you know, pretty cool stuff. I mean, look at this. This weird one, two, three, four, five, six. Has this weird thing here. Let's see if I can't back out just a hair bit. Okay. Now, I'm going to just color this here real quick. And we can take a look at this here up at the top left. And like I said, you can see right there that it has this one, two leg, and... This, to me, just, I mean, come on. If that doesn't scream intelligently made to anybody, oh, my God. I don't know what does, because that is definitely metallic in shape right there, and it looks like this may be separate. comes up, nice corner, another corner, up and over, and it looks like it keeps going, and it has a line right there. It's very faint, but this stuff here, this white something, rather, you can see it right there. It's not, 
it's not they they try to just take this thing out but it's it's really hot i mean that's really blurry there let's do this but i'm trying to just zoom in you know so it wouldn't be too bad but you can just see this line ring all the way down look at this and yeah and again that line running down now guys i again i don't know what this stuff is but it clearly doesn't look like just simple rock um Again, this is all this piece right here. Now, keep in mind, this is a distance away. This is the picture here. This is the actual, there's another plateau of or ground down here. And this appears to be a pretty high, this Opportunity Rover, which is a little thing. It's not very high off the ground like the Curiosity, which is like seven foot to the mast cam. So, yeah. Um, and like I said, that's, see how they did just dull this right out and low res? Well, okay. But anyway, guys, check it out. Tell me what you think this stuff is, man. I mean, I just... I'm going to zoom back into here. Tell me what you guys think this stuff is. I mean, this is definitely ruins and whatever this else is here. They just don't look like typical. Look at this. There's something actually rounded right there. And also an inner line that's rounded. At least appears to be. And there's something right there. So I don't even know what this stuff is even is. I, I really don't. But it looks like you can... I don't know if this is like a inside of something or it just goes th out through the other side and here's the thing guys we don't even know how big this stuff is and we really don't uh they don't give you any i don't know about you guys but if you guys have been in this for a long time if you go back to their recent pictures they like actually have uh like a like a paragraph under the picture you know like this is here at such and such a rock or crater or blah 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 and it would give you a description about where this curiosity is at or the you know the like in this case would be the uh, opportunity you know or whatever Suddenly nothing. You don't get anything out of it anymore. Um, there's something right here that appears to be like a weird shape right here. And it's all this whatever this is. But there's something very faintly. It's a round circle there. You can just see that. But there's all kinds of things just strewn up in here. I don't know right here. But give me your take on it, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Because there's clearly something here that just... It's just more pots, guys. <laughs> what can I tell you? It's just more pots strewn around. And, you know... I just love finding this this stuff. It's just it's really awesome. This to me, even if you don't believe a thing about any of the rest of this, I mean, this clearly has some stuff in it. I don't know if it's piping, some kind of what's left over from some, from some buildings or whatever. I mean, you don't see any walls, of course, but I mean, as far as like might be like uh, like I said, piping or different other things running across here. But this here, come on, without a reasonable doubt, that is no way is that is that natural. There's just no way. There's no two ways about it. This is definitely. And it has an opening right there, and it probably goes across, and that's why this thing is sticking right through the top of it. But anyway, guys, give me your take on it. Let me know what you think. I don't want to make it super long. Um, like I said, if uh, you know, I'm gonna try to knock out at least one or two of these at least today, and then if not, then tomorrow. So either way, we'll have you guys uh, get you guys some videos that you can check out because um, I just enjoy doing this stuff. All right, guys, let me rock and roll. You guys rock and roll. If you are just if you guys are just viewing, you want to subscribe, please do. Uh, hit the like button. Share these videos. Show people that there's more going on than NASA and JPL letting us know that what's really going on Mars here. They're just not. They're doing everything they can to just cover this stuff up. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And I will see you next pick.